Hello and welcome to another character creator spotlight. This time we are featuring the works of Sturm. I've gone ahead and pre-selected our characters that we'll be working with. We are going to be firstly and foremostly working with Vile. Vile is from the Mega Man X series, a game that I started playing uh, right around the time of Mega Man X4 and that has been and always will be my favorite because that's the one I was introduced with. Then we have a much more recent game development, Carry On the Devourer. I've not yet played the game, but I've certainly seen videos and images, and I can tell you, you know, this is Carry On. And then we have, of course, the old one, the king in yellow, Haster himself who will be banishing and driving mad the opponents. And today, to help support them and ensure that we can get their combos to go off, we have Layla, the Enchantress. And so, just keep in mind that we're going to be able to... <laughs> oh, yep, these are all yours. And we'll be able to get right in and... Get going, we are going to do an endless run. Of course I have my tactician charm. And, you know, we're going to do a start at the bottom. Just to get the feel of all of these characters. Okay. Come on, load up, load up, load up. It's been a while since I... Played pop up and playing a few other things, but we have Vile, and I'm so happy to have Vile as our main character. You know, I considered pairing Vile with Mega Man, but I wanted to show off Sturm and only have one guest star, the true support Layla, to get the characters more action. Alright. And I'm missing the second screen I usually look at to. Look at chat, so if I don't see yours right away, it's because I'm going back and forth. Alright. And we're going to put Layla back here. Now when we look at Vile, right now we have a 1 through 4 straight line shot, a very powerful close range shot, and an also very powerful 1 through 3 shot. Uh, it's going to probably be getting... Uh, the benefit of the additional AP from Layla f when we get the chance. Uh, Carry On's gonna be a controller pulling and then boosting self when enough damage is dealt. Now the King of Haster is the one I'm really excited about, if for no other reason than the lore, and this is just beautifully done. If you look at the art style, the shadowing, uh, the various things that are coming out, and have you seen the yellow sign? Okay, unspeakable presence. Enemy targets hostile ability at you! Target user confused. So we may want you up front. We're going to be confusing, and then we're going to be launching you, Nine Square. So yes, Haster. Do not make me wait. I love the audio. Absolutely love the audio. Okay. Um, I'll have you there, and then because Vile is going first... We'll move you up front. Now, Carry On's going to go last, and I'm a little bit saddened about that. Um, if we do that, we'll do a decent amount of damage. Uh, and, of course, the trooper does suppressing fire. That's okay. And, yeah, let's just finish off the smuggler. That has a nice feel to it, and I love the artwork of Vile. Uh, we talked a little bit about the artwork of Haster, and all of this is really great. Uh, let's see. Now, as for stream chat, Sturm, I'm, I'm going back to Discord. Um, I'm, I'm having only one screen to look at, so I'm going back and forth. <laughs> they get a lot more interesting as they level up. You think they all... Okay. They are... Uh, all have three abilities when they have their equipment, and carry on, carry on. Sorry if the chat is a little bit off, but I wanted to make sure that you got the spotlight you deserve. 
Okay, we're gonna... Uh, do I want to drive mad the trooper so that you die and stop suppressing me? Yes, yes I do. I don't have any more AP. Okay. And... Oh, do I... You know, I am gonna go ahead. We're gonna charm just to get that done and unfortunately carry on is there a side entrance there is a side entrance i'm very happy with that but we'll just pull and absorb no thank you okay we're out of ap you are welcome, Sturm. These are great characters. Vile might be going down, but he's done already so much damage. I am definitely going to do the bumpity boom. Oh, I love the decision you made there with the attack animation. Front runner. And I'm going to end our turn there. It is time. Shall we drive you mad? Excellent. And I say unto thee, be banished. Go and read. Nineteen abilities you can unlock. Carrion has three and Haster has four. Good to know. Now, anyone who is coming in for my YouTube channel, if you go to the Discord, and they list the Discord, I believe, on the Steam page, of pop-up dungeon then and it um sturm is quite active in that community and posts quite a few things so if you're impressed with the characters don't be afraid to check out sturm or really any of the other creators that we've featured kind of wish layla would be going first so i could hurry up and boost but we're gonna have vile again yes this is fun Okay. Front runner. And cherry blast. Excellent. I'm going to just end turn there. We're not going to move any f more forward. And how much is that going to cost? It costs zero, so I'm free to just launch you. You're dead. And that is the way I like it. And do not mess with Haster. I really like your Haster, Sturm. We talked about this uh, when I was making my Arothico. And I just... I, I was very tempted to, but I didn't want to feature my characters on your spotlight. Let's do Carry On. Since A, he'll go next. And B... He hasn't had a chance to really shine. Okay, I want to pull you right to me. We're unfortunately going not going to do enough damage in the first go, but we have haste. And we still have a turn left before that goes off. So our Delicatessen, which will exterminate, will try to go after Carrion. And that's okay. I didn't think they were full brothers. I thought they were half brothers. Uh... And for those not following along with the chat, Sturm just said Haster and Cthulhu are uh, actually brothers. Yeah, they would have been a, a very good team. And I think if we were doing a non-spotlight, I really kind of want to run them through uh, the new campaign that is being worked on. Just make it a creepy feeling campaign, especially if it's horror themed. Maybe run them through the horror um level of the wizard tower and show dracula and funkenstein what fear is all about although they're highly resistant to various effects um 20 physical power speed okay it says that's better all right we'll go with that
And again, we are just all just a dream, as are Cthulhu and Haster. If you follow Azatoth, just going around. Let's go ahead and go on to the next floor. But I mean, what crazy cult member would actually follow that? Eh, mobility. You, know, you don't need mobility as much, either of you. Let's give it to you. Alright, and if you're enjoying this so far, don't forget to leave a like below. It really helps make the channel more visible, especially the video. And if you want to see Sturm's creation getting out there on YouTube, uh, like, share, all of that fun jazz. Okay, here we are. We have Vile. Uh, nope, we're going to want to have you line up. One, two, three, perfect. And again, you're going to go first. We're going to have Haster go here because I have complete faith Vile is going to take care of the scrawny Knoll. And we're going to have Carrion go there. And this is a little bit risky. I don't typically like placing them so far in the action, but with this layout, I think it'll be fine, especially... Oh, I didn't mean to use that one, but that works. Oh, really? That didn't work. Now, I want to confuse someone who isn't going to die next turn, but I suppose this will have to do. And we'll, we'll let carry on deal with the rest. And, yeah, let's banish you. Launch you, and you are out of battle. <laughs> Oh, yeah, we do need Shub. Yes, Carrion has a pull for that. A Shub would be amazing. The color of outer space it would be good. Yep. Oh, make Azatoth. Oh, you know, I don't know if I want Azatoth in a game. We might wake him. I really don't want that. <laughs> Let's give this to Carrion. And I'm going to end the turn, save up some AP. Let's go there. We're going to have haste. Yeah, we're just barely not killing them. I almost wish the pull had a damage. Just so that I could finish him off. Oh, are we going to get backstabbed? We are, but carry on seems to be okay with that. Yeah, so anything that summons is typically really great. Did you just kill your imp? All right. Yeah, let's go and shoot from behind. And then Vile has a bit of an issue here that I don't have the ability to uh, fire through carry on. And I want to... Yes, we will definitely drive the dragon mad. And we'll leave it there. And so let's... Hasten you. I think Carrion will die. Yep, there goes Carrion. Uh, turn up the game sound? Sure. Let me... Uh, go to options, audio, and we'll turn the master audio up. Let me know if this gets too loud. And we can adjust it. Thanks for letting me know that's what you wanted. Okay. And you are, I was looking at a couple of other screens, you're summoning the various dragonlings, which I hope fails horribly. Get out of my way and, let me pass. and we have enough haste. Are you going to be completely immune to that? We're going to do two damage. It's not worth the AP. Unfortunately, that means oh, that we are a little bit... At a disadvantage against the dragon. Oh, that's interesting. I only grant my own wishes. Um, so if I charm you, will will your summon cause? And and we won't know. Uh, actually, I'm gonna just you know spend my AP running. 
We have haste there, and next turn we'll hopefully be able to do more. Yeah, that it. Oh, only one was summoned. That's great. Let's have some fun. Tiny bit too loud. Okay, I will adjust that through my studio. All right, there we go. Thanks. And yeah, let's. Can we just take care of the dragon? All right, Vile came through for us. And I love the book. I love the book. In fact, I don't think I noticed that before. The king in yellow. Yeah, Haster is the only one that I know of that has two avatars. Um, and they talk about this in various games. He typically will be played with two different avatars. There is the king in yellow, and then there's Haster, the one who cannot be named. Then I have named several, several, several times. Maybe I know a little bit too much. Uh, you know, they, Lovecraftian was my favorite uh, version of fear until I started finding out more about SCPs. Now it just depends on my mood. If you haven't checked out SCPs, uh, maybe look it up. I'm not really going to go into much detail for that. Yeah, let's... Uh, we are outside the range of the annoying gym rats, who I hate very, very much. We have confused. Love your audio for the king in yellow. And we will boost Vile. You know, one thing I kind of wish... Um, is they had an ability like in Gordian Quest that was potent. In other words, your stats don't affect it too much, and they can make it weaker than normal. But if they had something along those lines... Oh, unspeakable Presence, our first time. You're just reconfused. Oh, don't pick on Haster! You annoying gym rats. Gym rats don't do anything by themselves, but they are annoying as all heck. Oh, and of course you move close enough to do something, don't you? Okay, so, yeah, let's take care of that. Our haste went off. And we'll fire at the goblin in the back. Okay. And then I actually want to see, can we, oh, we cannot charm you. Fine. We'll charm the goblin with 10 AP, shall we? And, oh, I've done enough. Oh, no, I haven't. The cooldown just went off. Do you even lift, bro? I've been stunned. And... Yeah, let's... Do that. Do that. And the gym rat is slowly dying. The lobster is going to be an issue. Okay, and you just stunned me, and that's horrible. Uh, but I should be able to charm the gym rat now. I'm hoping if I can get into position. Nope. So let's boost carry on. And I think... Can I go yet? Nope. Oh, we're stunned again. I thought that I'd be able to pull him right there, but that was a mistake. No, this has gone terrible. You may get... No, my mistakes have cost me, and it's the evil gym rats. I'm going to blame that. Fortunately, they do have siphon, but we always seem to be... You know, let's trigger the stun. There we go. We're stunned, and carry on will siphon. And we still can't use it, and unfortunately, that's all carry on can do. 
and carry on is down. So now it's just a matter of Leela or Le yeah, Layla dying. I am um, yeah, everyone's gone. Everyone is gone. I dislike gym rats. Yeah, let's take a look at our charms. Yes, the run is over. Sad kitty. Let's take a look at our charms, see what we can do. I was running with just the tactician charm. I'm tempted to put on my wonderful economizer ring. We'll go ahead and do that. And... Hmm... Put on my diamond health and my damage reflection. Great combination. All right, let's do that again. I am going to go ahead. We'll take him off and we will add Arathico since we were talking about it earlier. And we will drive our opponents insane. And we'll just do the easy start. F start on floor seven, three floors down. Part of my problem with Layla is if you do just get to her last, you can't win. Not without additional abilities. Uh, you could theoretically win by having damage every turn happen. Alright, we're in post-apocalyptic. I think that's fitting. Now we have a lot more health. But technically we're six levels higher. Five levels higher. And should I make them come to me? Yes. You come to the king in yellow. Uh, Vile will wait out here. Arothico. And carry on. You can pull. So let's have you separate the weak. Which one is the arsenal charm? Is that the one where armor gets, or you have additional armor choices, or is that the one that increases the equipment uh, stat by 30%? I do have both of those. Let's see. And we're going to end turn. And because of our additional equipment uh, that we get at the higher level automatically, we have the Popcorn Demon, uh, the Acquire Arm Start, which... Uh, you start your turn, uh, target self, 2 AP. Very nice. Treasure Hunter and Knight is what you're talking about, yeah. I don't know the charms by name except for the Tactician, which is the one I primarily use when testing characters. Um, yeah, let's launch our missile. Oh yes, the party balloon. No party balloon for you, and can we still launch? We can. And yeah, let's deal with the Kraken. Little bit of a problem him moving up, but we're going to get our damage reflection out. Uh, we have the yellow sign. If confused, a whole lot of damage. I'm going to end the turn, see what happens. End the turn, I should have seen that. Okay, so you're just going to slap us around and basically try to kill yourself. You're doing more damage percentage to yourself than to Vile. Always great. Yeah, I mean, you'll kill yourself just on Vile. That's why I love health and damage reduction. Not defense and damage reduction, and not defense and health. But we've done more damage that. Alright, our advanced equipment summons additional Arothicos. So we're going to end our turn because there's no viable target, but we do have a viable target there. Let's go ahead and give you your abilities. And madness or maddening stare driven to darkness. All right. And because he's now guarding me, I can just wail on a Um, I don't want to, Purge Arothico, but we will go ahead and end there. Do not trifle with me, worm. 
Honestly, I'm not sure if I have it. I'll have to go through. I, I went through the wiki earlier getting all of... Or making sure I got all of them. Let's see. Yeah, let's go ahead. I don't want to confuse Arathico. And he... Unfortunately... We're just going to have to get rid of the guy providing the guard. Just so that we have access further in. And you're gone. And there is no one who is confused. Okay. And yeah. You may have taken out Vile, but Dr. Pepperoni is down by two. Let's confuse you. Wonderful. Always love to see that. Okay. And let's... Whoops. Yeah, let's go and move out of the way. We'll maybe get Carry On in there if we can. Arathico and other Arathico, you just stay back there. It's time for the King in Yellow to just be stunned. And now we have Arachnotipsis. Okay. We're going to go ahead and get there. Hope hopefully we can get... Oh, not enough damage. But we're going to keep you from moving. You die, and the unyielding is turn. And there we go. Run, weaklings. It pleases me. Okay, so acquire arm system, hateful healer. I'll do that. Resurrect. Do we really want Arethico bringing people back from the dead? We'll say sure. Because they'll come back completely sane. Alright, so we've had a few battles. I'm going to quickly go to the charm section to see what Sturm is referencing. See if I have that. Oops, not that. Okay, binoculars, bull charm... My Mind Charm, Knight's Charm, Blacksmith's, Treasure Hunter's, uh, Prodigious Charm, Fortunate Charm, Summoner's Charm, Shapeshifter's Charm. So, no, I don't have it. Looks like I've missed that and we'll have to go back and get it. So, I hope everyone here had an enjoyable time looking at Sturm's creations. They were very good. I quite enjoyed watching it myself. And getting into each of the characters. Uh, again, King in Yellow. I have an unfair bias towards that. But Carrion was good. Uh, we will absolutely roll for gold. And get the missing charm. Uh, but again, if you've enjoyed this. Check out Sturm's Creations. Or just check out Sturm on Discord. I am Nidanoski. Thank you all for joining and for coming and watching. And have fun.